You've heard it many times. Success consists of an enormous amount of small victories. But what are these victories? This is the right question. The answer is simple and difficult at the same time. These are victories over yourself. Many people forget about working on their own mistakes and weaknesses. They just blindly follow their own guideline. They truly believe that the reason of all of their problems is somewhere outside, but they forget about the main thing. Everything what's happening is hidden in themselves, so inner balance and personal growth is the key to success. In this video, I'll tell you why the person who constantly improves himself, he always wins. And I'll start from the life story. When I was about 15 years old, I just started to use the method of a constant improvement. These were my first steps. The essence is very simple. First, you have to understand in which direction you need to develop what you want to come to. And next, just every day on a constant basis, take small steps towards it. I remember that time I was writing all my ideas, all my thoughts on a piece of paper and it definitely helped me to feel myself. Once a year I bought an A4 folder and on a daily basis I put there inside the analytics on a piece of paper of the last 24 hours of my life. I always was talking to myself in some kind of quiet place where nobody was distracting me and I was asking myself a question. Am I today better than yesterday? It was convenient because every day I saw in which direction I go and in most cases this direction suited me. At that point I consolidated the idea Constant improvements are the key to success. I loved reading my analytics from a month ago and watching which weaknesses I have conquered during this time. I didn't have such moments when I was watching at my nose and realizing <laughs> I don't have a progress. I didn't have them. And thanks to my analytics I realized I wouldn't go so far if I don't have a consistent approach. When you do one target action after another, you start a system mechanism. To eat an elephant, you need to do this in small pieces. Don't try to put it in your mouth at once. Everything works the same here. Build a system that will stimulate you to the constant growth. This is the secret that many don't even think about. Moving chaotically won't get you far. Since that moment I've had a lot of victories. It wasn't an easy path. And it's not easy now for sure. I think many of my achievements were completed precisely because of the fact that I created the system of small steps towards the goal. To see the effect you need to try this approach on your own experience. There is no different way. And now I want to talk about three principles on which this idea is built. The first is that only by moving slowly we can regulate our course. When you move little by little in the direction of your goal, you can track all the changes in your trajectory. When you move little by little in the direction of your goal, you can track all the changes in your trajectory. Some actions will be quite effective, some not, but you will be able to steer here and now. If you try to grow only by huge leaps, you can jump in the wrong direction and find yourself in quite tough situation. When you're just starting your journey, it's better to move carefully. The big leaps, they'll come. Try to constantly analyze what's happening in your life and find the best way for you to do this. For example, for me, it was just a piece of paper and a pen. They will be your guide and will not allow you to get confused, otherwise it's quite easy to do. Don't be greedy for quick results. Everything requires time and the force. It's better to move further, not faster. You will achieve a lot if you keep up the pace and look at the situation sensibly, consistently rising the bar. If I was just starting to drive, I wouldn't take a supercar right away. Do you know what I mean? For the first practice, I would choose something not so powerful just to stay safe after the first turn. And then, of course, I would move to the dream car that can give me any speed I need. Be careful at the very beginning, but watch every move and analyze what's happening around you. Second, many small victories, they create a habit to develop. It's very important to understand that any development is a system. You basically can't become the best in something just in one day. Look at any world-class athlete. Their business is their life, they won't be themselves without the constant practice. When the zone of your personal development becomes the part of your day, you will see the crazy progress. It will follow you everywhere. The most important stuff here is just not to feel relaxed and not to forget about your goals. The effect of one small victory will be quite tough to notice, but 10 of them will change something. When you will have hundreds of such victories, you will feel that your life it became better, you reached a new level. Now imagine that every week you move step by step to where you want to be. How do you think in one year would you be able to praise yourself for the path that you traveled? I believe yes, for sure. In the moment your achievements, they can look quite insignificant. And in order not to devalue them, 
try to use a diary. Its task will be to give you the opportunity to look back and always remember where you were some time ago. It won't let you forget about how much have you already gone through and at the same moment it will keep you updated about man, everything is ahead. This has worked amazing for me and it also incentivized me to move forward so many times. So, create a system and let it push you to the goal step by step. Third, continuous self-improvement opens up new horizons. What you do depends on your mindset. But there is one downside that many people forget about. Your thinking also depends on your actions. Everything is interconnected, it influences each other. If you lead an idle life, you will think like a person who is unable to change. But if you leave your comfort zone and look at your future without any illusions, your consciousness, it will develop. New horizons will open for you and the boundaries of possible will just expand you will start looking at things differently. But this effect will come only if you are consistent in your actions. This is basically the main recipe for everything. And you know it's even cooler. There will always be a compound effect, meaning that your speed of development, it will go faster and faster during the process. What seemed impossible yesterday, today will be quite achievable and tomorrow it will be your reality. Here I can recommend to talk to yourself and try to evaluate all of your actions from the outside. And also you can make the following. Just find a friend who will keep an eye on you to make sure that you won't stop on the way of development. I personally believe that the self-motivation works better, but it depends on your approach. The most important here is to never pause and watch how your perception of possible changes. I hope that my reflections, they made you believe that the growth is the way of life. When you'll make the movement forward and constant development the part of your day, you'll become invincible. Guys, thank you so much for watching my videos. Yes, as usually, I'll repeat it once again, I appreciate you and I appreciate that you are watching my content. So if you like this video, give me your like. If you don't, give me your dislike. Follow my channel and see you tomorrow, guys. Thank you so much.